Hello, this is Ken Alstrom with Real Circularity, and I'm here today again with Trisha Carey from RenewCell. Hi, Trisha. Hi, Ken. Great to have this time again to chat with you. Well, it's amazing that uh, you know a little over a year has gone by since we did an original podcast about RenewCell and all the forward-looking, um, exciting work that was going on there. And suddenly, several weeks ago, the bankruptcy was announced. And that's obviously sent ripple waves throughout the whole circularity movement and in the fashion industry who were looking very closely at what you were doing. And I'm I'm so thrilled that you've agreed to come to speak with us um, at the summit that we're having in June on real circularity to share some of the learnings, because I'm sure that with all that's gone on over the last you know week since the bankruptcy was announced, there's got to be an immense amount of learning that you, you've taken on board that's so much value for everybody to to take from what's happened so that we can we can learn and, and do better in the future. Exactly, Ken. Uh, you know, quite unfortunate the situation for Renew Cell, um, but it's not just the situation for Renew Cell, but also our partners and the industry overall. Uh, and I think, you know, one thing that we feel and I personally believe is that if we cannot use this time uh, and the situation at Renew Cell as an, uh, ideas of what we need to have and going forward, we need to learn from mistakes uh, and make sure that we can right some of the wrongs so that other innovators have a chance to bring new materials into market. So I'm really happy to talk again with you and your audience and have the chance to discuss further these challenges and really hear from both sides. Uh, I certainly have my perspective sitting here uh, at Renew Cell and, and know that there's complexities within circularity without a doubt, but how do we overcome this? You know, we've been in the linear chain for so long and now that we look at more of the network effect that's going to have uh, with circularity and the interdependence that the market will have um, in different players. It's no longer who is coming before you and supplying you with materials and, and who's the next part of the chain, but it's everyone together. And I think this is the biggest challenge that the industry has, is everyone coming around the table at the same time with the same agenda. 